Hi, Nia. It's Lisette. I hope you're doing well. Today, we're going to read another story. This one is called Play-Doh. Oh, lots of fun with Play-Doh. Okay, let's get to it. Play-Doh written by Anne Har. Tyra loved Play-Doh. She rolled it, she patted it, she punched it, and she shaped it. At school, there was blue Play-Doh and red Play-Doh. Every day, there was a different color. Kyra loved them all. I wish I had Play-Doh at home, she said to her teacher, Mrs. Peck. Where do you buy it? Mrs. Peck laughed. I don't buy it. I make it. Can you show me how? Kyra said. The next day, Kyra walked into the classroom. Good morning, everyone, said Mrs. Peck. Today we will make Play-Doh. Kyra will help you. Kyra stood next to Mrs. Peck. Everything we need is on the table, Mrs. Peck said. We have our salt, excuse me, we have flour, salt, oil, water, and food coloring. Kyra, please put two cups of flour into the bowl. Kyra measured the flour. She dumped it into the bowl. Two cups of flour, she said. Next, we need one cup of salt, said Mrs. Peck. Kyra measured the salt. She dumped it into the bowl. She's pretty clean. Mrs. Peck handed Kyra a spoon next, makes the flour and the salt. Kyra mixed them carefully. Next, we need one tablespoon of oil and one cup of water. Kyra put them both into the bowl. I would have had a mess already. Now stir it well, Mrs. Peck said. Kyra stirred until her arm was tired. It looks like white Play-Doh, she said. What color shall we make? Mrs. Peck held up the food coloring. Blue, Amid said. Red, Rena added. I have an idea, said Mrs. Peck, and she poked a hole in the Play-Doh. She put in five drops of blue food coloring and five drops of red food coloring. Squish it all up, Kyra. Kyra squished the Play-Doh. She rolled it and patted it. She punched it and shaped it. Kyra's eyes grew big. The children in the classroom all smiled as the white Play-Doh turned a beautiful shade of purple. Thank you, Mrs. Peck. I can't wait to make Play-Doh at home, Kyra said. That sounds like a fun idea. Maybe that's something that you can ask your parents if you can do at home. I hope you enjoyed this book. We'll see you again soon.